Hello everyone, it's Tubitus here, and today I'm gonna give. <coughs> Sorry, today I'm gonna be doing a tutorial on how to make the line look better in Flash. Because when I was starting out, like I have a lot of problems to make the line look good because I didn't like the line in Flash. It was like horrible, as you can see here, for example. So I made a series of tips. This is the third episode. So if you haven't seen the first and the second one, definitely go see them. Like get out of this video, go to my channel and search how to make the brush look good in flash. And there you will find like the part one and the part two, and then you can see the part three. Right? So in those other parts, I gave two tips that are really important, but if that's not enough, I'm gonna give you this last tip, okay? So let's imagine that you're drawing like some character or something. Like for example, like this, like, I don't know, dude. I'm drawing with the, with the mouse, so it's gonna be horrible anyways. So let's say, for example, the eyebrow. As you can see, this eyebrow right here is like ugly, right? Why is that? Because we're doing it like this. We're just doing one line to make the eyebrow. So let's say that you don't want the line to look like this. What you want, what you can do is like you can zoom in just as I did here. Like you can go here, go zoom 400%. And instead of doing this one line like this, you just draw the line exactly how you want it to be, right? And then you fill it up with the black paint and it looks like it's a line, you know what I'm saying? Like it's the same thing. Just that it looks a lot better. Like let's compare this one right here to this one right here. This is a lot better because we did it with purpose. We did it like exactly how we wanted it to be. And that's what makes it a lot different and a lot better so that's the tip basically that's the tip that i'm giving you today i hope it really helps you there could be like a whole bunch of other examples of how you could use it but i think this is a pretty good example right here and yeah man like in my channel i have more than a hundred videos more than a hundred i actually have like 200 videos but i have like more than a hundred tutorials on english and spanish so if you are, if you know how to talk Spanish too, you should watch the, the Spanish videos. They are basically the same, just in different languages to like be able to provide more value. You know what I'm saying? And the other thing is like, I have flash tutorials and Photoshop tutorials specifically. So if you're learning about those two things or like one of those two things, definitely subscribe because I will be uploading new content and I, al I already have a lot of content that you can watch so yeah thank you for watching and see you on the next one